Hey guys, welcome to your week one video on the fall session of nutrition. This month we're talking about the mental and emotional aspects of eating and when it comes to trying to eat in a healthier way, how all of that starts up here in the mindset. And we discussed last night, I gave you some points, I gave you some homework, and some of the things we talked about is how your mindset has to be different than it used to be. So I want you to really pay attention this week and become aware of what you are thinking. Become aware of the mindset that you've had all along and the new mindset that you're trying to create, that you're trying to come up with for yourself. So that's what you wanna start paying attention to. You can't change things if you're not aware of them. So this week, you wanna really remember to stop and pay attention. For example, if you're making a poor choice or you did make a poor choice, then what was going on in your mind at the time? What caused you to make that choice? What were you thinking? What were you feeling? I talked about the meaning that we give these thoughts, the meaning we give these experiences or these events. So you want to start paying attention to what that is. I also want you to start looking at the mindset that got you here, the mindset that, that keeps you in this path of making not so healthy choices. You're here because you want to eat better. And so what is the mindset that has gotten you there? The way you figure that out is to see and examine what thoughts you're thinking when you make these healthy choices and more importantly, when you make the not so healthy choices. So start paying attention to that. Also want to look at the mindset of someone who does eat in the way that you are trying to eat. In other words, a healthy person, a person who makes healthy choices, a person who makes health and eating in a healthy way their top priority. How do they think? What do they think? In other words, they do they uh, prepare ahead of time before they go out? Do they think about that ahead of time? What's going on in their brain? So try to really think about what the mindset of someone who's making the choices that you would like to make for yourself, what is that mindset made up of? the way they look at things, the way they view things, the way they give meaning to things. So those are the things you wanna really pay attention to. I also have asked you to pay attention to these habits, these comforting habits. A lot of times food is used as a comfort for a stressful day, for a, you know, you don't have a whole lot of energy, lots of different reasons. So when you go into these habits, these habits a lot of times are associated with comforting you in some way, making things easier on yourself in some way. So next week I am gonna post a video on how to, just some tips to help you change habits, but this week in order to change those habits, you want to start paying attention to what the habits are. In other words, does, do you find that you're always going for the easy convenience foods when you're tired, when you're stressed? Are you finding you need to have sugar after meals? What are the habits that are keeping you on this path that is not leading in the direction you're wanting to go? So that's your homework for this week. I told you that at the class. Um, so you should have your outline or your just your little sheet that I gave you with the notes on it. Pay attention to what we talked about, write it down, do that this week. And hey, by the way, thank you so much for all your patience when we were having all those technical difficulties. We hopefully, I think, have those ironed out so we won't be having that next month with any luck. Um, but thank you so much for your patience. And next week I will post a video on this YouTube channel about tips for breaking some of those habits or making better habits, okay? So please comment below with any questions or comments you have that will help. Um, I can answer some questions there. So, okay. I hope this helps guys and good luck.